Kibbe glazed mochi donut with a lot of fruity pebbles and some powdered sugar on top. Guys, what is up and welcome to a new video on my channel. I'm Alan, 27 years, I'm from Germany and right now it's time for a new cheat day video. It's really late, I gotta say, it. yeah, almost 0.30 in the night, and, but we will start a little bit earlier or late, you can say. And after the gym, guys, I got so big cravings for pizzas that I got last weekend without the camera, so without uh, recording. But I got so big cravings again for the pizza and here we have it, guys. Beef prosciutto pizza. And look at, oh, and look at this amazingness. This is the Mona Lisa of pizza for me. Zero twenty-seven in the night. All right, guys, I make the pizza into four slices and put the tomatoes away, just because. Yeah, tomatoes are okay, but you maybe you know me, guys. I'm not the biggest fan of veggies. This is a quality thing for us pizza from an Italian restaurant. Let's start our cheat day with the pizza. Why not? Again, I'm more in my mouth, guys. Oh. Salinio Tomas This is for you my friend for all Italy peoples mm. Mm. Then the beef prosciutto Carpaccio, I don't know what this is but this is so amazing. Mm. So I will enjoy this delicious pizza right now. Watching some tool time. An old sitcom maybe. And I love the crust. Mmm. I love the crispy edges from a thin crust pizza. Oh my god, yeah. Weighting was over 500 grams for the pizza. So it's a really hefty one. Because a lot of stuff is going on. So easy. About 1500 calories. But it's totally worth it, guys. Oh, oh yeah. Mm. So time for the last slice of pizza. And it was amazing. Only the tomatoes left, but yeah, who cares? Guys. I'm so in love, this is not normal, I was so hungry, but right now I feel so amazing. So just relaxing and watching. Mm. But stay tuned for a lot of more good stuff will come. You know my cheat days. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe guys, I got a lot of amazing cheat days that you have to see. Last piece, guys. That was buenissima. And this is why I prefer more Italian style pizza. Nothing that is too greasy or something. My hands are still more like clean. Mm. And the quality and the freshness is so amazing. Mm. I'm really stoked about the pizza. It's it was. They nailed the pizza, guys. Definitely. So, that was meal number one. Just a quick pizza session. But stay tuned for the next meal, guys. We will have a lot. Eleven o two the next morning, guys. After the pizza, I also baked some goodies for my next meal. But first, right now, we'll hit the gym. Then I will pick up some food. We'll cut my hairs maybe, the sides, and then, yeah, we will see us with the next meal, so stay tuned.
for a lot of delicious sweets. We are back from the gym and I also took a haircut and I pick up some food and also some food that I want to eat later. But first, just because it's still bright outside, I want to make myself a little barbecue just because I have a barbecue grill on my balcony and uh, yeah. So I will prepare the next meal and then it's time to dig in. So stay tuned. Three forty-three, guys. Time for the next meal, and you saw it. We got a big platter of deliciousness with chicken sausages. They call tavuk sausages. These are from a Turkish supermarket. Then we also got a herb butter baguette. So it's filled with herb and butter, and it's super delicious, but also really high in calories. But it's a cheat day, so who cares? And also we got the elote. I spice this up with some coriander spices and also chili powder and grilled everything just to perfection with some butter. This is my savory platter and on the sweet side we got a lot of things guys. So let's throw out first a quark bällchen so they're not filled just deep fried delicious dough oh mm. they are delicious definitely simple but so good my first dessert today in the cheat day because after the pizza I eat and nothing else Number four, the last one. First blueberry muffin. Let's see if this will be good. Mm. Super soft, moist in the inside. Mmm. I pay only one euro for a bag of six, but the other three ones I give to my family. Oh wow, well, I have to make an Instagram story guys. This is a pumpkin cream cheese glazed with some kinaku powder on top. And I hope that this is really like a mochi, so the texture, because no yeast, nothing. Oh! Mmm, super chewy, like a mochi, you can see it, oh yeah, I love it, okay, let's kill this blueberry muffin and then we go to the savory items, what is funny about this meal guys, when I was a kid, Every time when I come home from school, I make me these sausages because we got them every time at home because they're really cheap. You become a box with 40 of these sausages for only 5 euros in the Turkish supermarket, Tavuk sausages, and they're amazing. Super fatty, but really not the healthiest meat or best meat, but it works. I eat this every time with some Lebanese flatbread, like a wrap. And when we do barbecues, always with these herb buttered filled baguettes. And I don't know when I got, I got really no idea when I ate the last time these sausages and the baguettes, or many years ago. Easy three or four. And I'm so happy right now. This is really a childhood thing. Mm. And the baguette is so amazing. And with a lot of ketchup. And the butteriness. Mmm.
Let's try the loot. Oh. oh, the spices. I use so much chili powder. I can strictly feel it on my tongue. Mm. But still super buttery. Mm. I love corn. Yeah, the corn is gone. <laughs> Too fast, but it was super delicious. More baguette. Baguette! Mm. And this mochi donut got a lot of matcha glaze, a white chocolate matcha cookie and also a lot of kinaku powder and powdered sugar on top so let's see it it's supposed to be looks like a ponder ring but yeah i fucked up a little bit it was my first time that i make this so but let's see and seeing what i have within me if you decide to drop your buckets where you are Whoa. and develop your gifts definitely you can taste you never, ever be without. and I see that this is a rice dough Mmm, super sticky. Like a mochi, got to be. Mmm. <laughs> I like it. When I was in Japan, I ate the pondering. But this one is amazing too. Well, even better. Mmm. I love it. For this croissant and it's filled with marzipan. Let's see. Oh yeah. It's definitely filled with marzipan. Maybe you can see it in the center. Almost got the same color. <laughs> like the dough. Mm? Oh, now you can see it definitely. Mmm. Well, I love marzipan. Damn. Oh, wow. I definitely need to buy me more. Let me know, guys, if you want to see a 10,000 or more calorie. Cheat day with only German bakery items. I would love to make a, a big feast with only German bakery goodies. My blowing. So far, the second meal was so delicious. Mm. Also, my last one. Here we got the ube glazed mochi donut with a lot of fruity pebbles and some powdered sugar on top. Mm -hmm. oh. Strictly the glaze ube cream cheese. Mm. And again, the dough is so sticky. Mm. I love it. Eight forty-three in the night, guys. Time for the last round. And I told you guys after the gym I will p pick up some food, and here we got it from Yushimi. It's an amazing Asian cuisine restaurant in my city. For everybody who lives in Osnabrück, go to LNT and the Market Hall. And guys, trust me, they got delicious Asian curries and also some sushi rolls that I love me the most because this is not your typical sushi. They make kind of a European style as well. Also, we got a lot of things that I want to try. So we got some stuff from my home country. But also we got a lot of stuff from Canada. Or that I become from Canada. From my good friend Ron. 
He also got a YouTube channel. Link is in my description box down below. Thank you so much again. This guy sends me over 10 kilograms of treats, cheats and only goodness from Canada. And it means a lot to me. So I have to share some food that he sent me. And make some shoutouts for his channel for sure. Because he's an amazing dude. So check him out guys. He also do cheat days. And every day he posts some food reviews. And also from my mom. A baked apple. Filled with a lot of marzipan and nuts and some vanilla ice cream on the side. Let's try out this ones here. The cheeses from Canada. And I love cheese, chips, corn puffs, snacks, everything. Mmm. Super cheddary. Oh wow. Call them Jesus and not Jesus. The uh, Jesus are amazing. Mmm. Some crumbs left. That is all. But look at this bad boy here. Oh my god, this is so a big corn puff or chip. So next item. They eat more. Chocolate bar. Original dark toffee peanut candy. I have to be honest, I'm not the biggest fan of dark chocolate and fudge. But let's see. Okay. It's, it's good. The peanut makes it really delicious. Mmm. Now let's try out the air fried European Twinkie. <clears throat> I love it. I prefer it so much more than to a regular one. Blueberry cheesecake filled bun. I got no idea if this will be good because sometimes they're really cheap with the filling. Yeah, not so heavy with the filling. Let's see. Mm, okay. That's a cream cheese. Cheesecake filling. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. And the blueberry. Okay, it's delicious, definitely. This one is super good. Let's eat some of the ice cream before it becomes too melty. Mm. Maybe you can see it guys, a lot of marzipan baked into the apple. Oh yeah, in combination with the vanilla ice cream and the apple is still warm. Mm. All the marzipan and apple in combination. Mm. And we got six different rolls so many different rolls that is crazy they got so many different rolls so here we got the tuna salad sushi roll mm. oh yeah it is delicious rucola mango and cream cheese so for all the veggies Mmm. Oh, mango. I love mango. Guys, the next roll is super Italian. This is a. Okay, it's a little bit broken right now, but it's a 
carpaccio roll was beef carpaccio, rucola, parmesan, and balsamico dressing. That sounds fancy. Mmm. And it's so delicious. And that is why I love this spot. Mmm. Because it's not your typical sushi. Next one is spicy tuna. Okay guys, in this roll, I got to check it out because at first I was thinking they got pickles in it, but there's no pickles, they are just teriyaki chicken and cheese. Damn, no, it's a little bit broken, but who cares? Let's try it out. Teriyaki chicken and cheddar cheese. Oh wow. Totally forget it, we got the salt and vinegar chips. Fire. They are super good. Last roll guys. My favorite one that I knew, I got this before, was crispy chicken, avocado and peanuts. Oh, it's so good. So. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Ron, by the way, 9 out of 10. I'm a bit full. I, I still forget we got the Mrs. Freshly. Dreamies. Cream filled cakes. So this is going to be my last item for today's cheat day. Inside look. Like a sponge cake with cream filling and a raspberry coating. So let's see. It's a typical cream and sponge cake flavor. Guys, we also got some coconut flakes on top. And the flavor of the coconut is stronger than the raspberry. I really taste no raspberry. Not a real raspberry taste. But still super delicious. I will give them an 8. Mmm. Mmm, I love this texture. Again, so moist. Mmm. Perfect end. Mmm. Overall, it was amazing. I'm super happy. I'm not too full and I think in two or three hours when you follow me on Instagram you will see that I will eat again something. But only for my Instagram followers. You know the drill every time after a cheat day video. But yes, that was all. I hope you guys like it and we will see us in the next video. Stay tuned and if you want to see me doing a bakery feast with only German goodies or a sushi feast or something else. Let it me know, write it down in the comments. Peace out from Germany. And by the way, also a happy new year, guys.